loud. Okay, now hush. Let me show you what we're working with here. Ready? So we're going to do this. Oops. And then we want to go this route. Turn that around. There we go. Let's see if I can not screw this up. Hey, hey guys, it's Tark with Cycling FPV. That's my son Landon right here. Uh, I told my boys that I want everybody to get involved in tonight. We're going to have a little bit of fun. And so I've got uh, oh, here, let me show them. Sorry, you're gonna have to bear with me a little bit. Hey, where are you going, Turkey? Come here. I don't care about the door. Come here. I want to show you something. So, what you're gonna look for is you're gonna look and try to see it on here. See, like, see, oh, there we are. I'll say we're live right now, but there's about, oh, wait, let me, sorry, let me turn this down. Let me turn this down about, uh, there's about a 35 second delay between what we say and when they hear it, okay? So, can you say hi? Hi. Don't look at yourself. Look up there. Look hi. right there. See right there? Yeah. Right there where my finger is. Say hi. All right, so <clears throat> I told my boys they've been they have been um, oh and if you want to look at what people are saying, see how you can say that right there. So you can say hi to Dustin and Jeremiah and Brian. What's up, Brian? What's up? What's up, Dustin? Everybody, Ricardo, how y'all doing? Uh, let me go ahead and put this up here. We'll put this right here, okay? And that way you can read what they're saying, um, and you can respond to them if you want, right? Well, not right now, huh? No, you don't have to whisper. It's okay. So, uh, so my boys have been watching the YouTube, um, uh, whatchamacallit, um, subscriber? Is that it? Yeah. They've been watching it, man. They, they watch it more than I do. They're like, oh, we're going to get there. We're going to get there. So today, uh, I know it's not a big feat for a lot of y'all, especially these guys that, are, that my kids watch that have got like millions and millions of people. But for us, it's a big deal, right? And, and I got to say that my wife and my boys here, man, they have been nothing but like excited. I mean, like. Hold on, hold on, Michael. That don't, doesn't go here. I'm going to explain the rules, Michael, in just a minute. Hang tight a second. Hey, 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 relax there, boy. We, we don't read so close. Anyway, so I told them tonight that we're going to get prepared for tomorrow's giveaway, right? Now, we have a live build tonight. Um, we are going to be building, uh, our, finishing our Dragon uh, drone here for Paul. And um, at the same time, I'm, I'm really thankful I got my boys with me because we're all going to be doing the giveaway tomorrow. Uh, there'll be a DJI Phantom, one of mine. Uh, it'll have a, thanks Ricardo, it'll have a, it'll come with a case. I mean, it's, oh, there's my other son. Where is he at? Come here. Come here. I'm going to take the phone inside, actually. I'm going to go take it inside my house for a minute and, and have my wife and my other son on there, too. Because tomorrow we're going to be giving <laughs> a bunch of things away. The big prize is going to be a drone. Um, and then we're going to do some other small prizes. I mean, like flight controllers, okay. props frames. I mean, you name it, we're going to do it. Hey, I'm coming inside. Everybody, no, no, come on now that you're here. Come on, get over on this. Side. Where's Jaden? He's on the couch. All right, so everybody wants to get, that's my wife, Sam, and y'all have seen her. She did her one video debut that was really squirrely. <laughs> so you got Sam, Landon, Ashton, my dog down there. And we're going to go raid. We're going to go get my little son real quick because he's kind of being a butt and just sitting inside. So we're going to get him. So let me, let me uh, do this. Let me do this. Let me get this camera. Let me switch this around. There we go. And as soon as I'm done, and here we go. All right, so we're going to go inside. Let's go get my other son real quick because he's not getting up. Ready? Ready? Ready. All right, we're going to go get him. Here we go. But just sit there on the couch. Maybe no one's coming for you.
pick up the stuff. All right, now, time to get back. So let me get over here because I can't see any comments. I can't do anything. I don't even know if this is recording. But here we go. Let me switch back to the camera. And we are going there. Bam. All right. <laughs> so, no audio. Oh, no. Sorry, guys. I forgot if there was no audio. That's my bad. Uh, we'll fix it next time. Anyways, that was my family. Uh, and what we were saying in there, I forgot that there was no audio, was that... Um, uh, uh, oh my god, I've lost my train of thought. Sorry, what we were saying was that they are going to be picking the prizes for tomorrow, and those prizes are going to include anything they want. I'm letting them come in here and grab whatever they want, whatever they think, as long as they don't go crazy. We're going to do some motors, some stuff. This is our big thousand subscriber. Uh, oh, you did here. Okay. So, our big thousand subscriber thing, it's our way of saying thanks. My kids were super pumped, which makes me really excited um, to have them be uh, a part of it. Um, yeah, I forgot that the audio stayed in here. My bad. Okay. So, uh, also, Brian, uh, Brian was one who helped me work on a way to do the um, new giveaway, right? And so what he came up with, I remember I asked you guys how to do it. And what he came up with was a way to um, basically have a channel, a YouTube, like a video. And then from that, you guys will post to that video. Now, that video will just be for the drawing. And so you'll just post and then we'll go through it. Um, so uh, I think what we'll do is we'll look at that real quickly. And then we'll get started on our build, okay? Because I know tomorrow's giveaway is going to be the most expensive one I've done. And I really want to make sure that if there is... Thanks, guys. I appreciate you. If there is anything that we're screwing up on before this giveaway, I've got to fix it. Because I want everybody to feel that it was unfairly. I want everybody to have a chance at it. So let me... Um, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to share the screen here. Um, and let's do this. Boom. There's the computer screen right now. I'm going to open up the browser, and I'm going to show you what I think was what was recommended to me, right? Uh, and Brian, if you're there, please, uh, please let me know. Uh, is there a video? If you're not getting video, let me know, please. Uh, I, I'm seeing it, so uh, Dustin, try to redo it maybe. I'm, I'm not sure if there's a problem there, but all right, so let me show you what I've done. Um, under, the YouTube, under the YouTube video, I created a... Uh, I created a video right here, right? It's called June 16th, 2019. Oh, it should have been July. God darn it. I screwed that up. All right. So already I screwed it up. Oh, it says July in here. So I'll just change the title. Um, so let me go and edit that real quick because I want to give this a shot and make sure that it makes sense. So let me go ahead and edit and let's see what we got. Okay. All right. So I'm going to edit this to say July 16th. Let me get the keyboard and see what we got. And then by doing this, I think this is going to work. Uh, and, and let's see if this does prove to be fair to everybody. So July 16th. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to save this. <clears throat> and I'm going to, this will be the link that you post to, right? So I will take uh, the video, copy the video URL. And I will go to our Facebook page, which is right here. And when I post the video, like for tomorrow's live video, uh, I will put this link there as well. Hey, Aaron, what's up, big boy? Um, yeah, I know it's been a while. George, I'll tell you what. I wanted this 1,000 mark to hit, and it hit. And I said, I told everybody, as soon as we hit that 1,000, I'm going crazy on the videos. I'm going to make sure we go big. So here's what I'm going to do. When I do the description of the video, I will put in the link. And so if you guys want to see it, here's the link here, right? So I'm just going to paste it and hit enter. Okay. I hope this will pull up the link. I don't know if it's going to or not, but um, that should, ah, darn it, of course it wouldn't put up the link like that, but if you could just, oh yeah, there you go. So now what you'll do is you'll basically click on this, right? Now this will be in the description, but for this one, uh, I didn't do that, but the point being is I want you to be able to click on that, and then from here, all you're gonna see is the intro. It says uh, the date and the contest, that's it. Here is where you will post, here's where you will post your comments. And what it will be is Cyclone FPV, and it tells you that. I don't know why it's going to the next one. Um, I need to tell it not to do that, but uh, go back, please. I don't know how to do that. I'm still new to this crap. Uh, bear with me a second. Um, how the hell do you go back? Where's my video? Okay, so what you can see is it tells you here one comment per subscriber, and make sure to put Cyclone FPV. So when you put that in there, we're going to go from this video to pull the winners, right? So the 17th will have another set of winners. And the 18th will have another one, okay? Now, I'm only seeing three videos on it, three uh, things right now. So for tonight, 
um, please make sure to put in, like it says, Cyclone FPV. But that video is only for that. Hopefully that makes sense, okay? And then what we're gonna do is from there, I will draw the video, I'll draw the winner from the random selection like normal, uh, like we did before, all right? So, this is how it's gonna be. This should be the most, I hope, diplomatic way to do it, where you have one video just for the contest posting, and then we have our live video, which we're gonna keep on Facebook for now, because we have a lot more subscribers on Facebook to get the word out, okay? So let's try it and see if it gets screwed up. Now, I have a couple things to give away. I do want to try this out tonight, so please, if you're watching, please click that link uh, that I just posted. Uh, it's on autoplay in your settings. I don't know where the heck that is. Um, this all this technology, I'm too old for this, man. I'm telling you what, I'm just getting too darn old. But let me see if I can find, okay, so here's my settings, and I guess I just click, oh no, if I click loop, whatever, I'll figure that part out, okay? Um, Okay, so, um, all right, so hopefully that'll work then. So in either case, I'd like you guys to check that out and make sure that we don't see a problem with it because like I said, we're gonna probably give about, I don't know, maybe, uh, I mean, at least $1,000 worth of things away tomorrow and probably more, right? I mean, more. And it's gotta be fair, guys. I, I've gotta make sure it's fair. Okay, so please check that out. We will be, I will be picking some winners tonight, but right now uh, I only see like four comments in there or three comments in there there has to be more because if there's not then it means i'm screw oh wait now there's now there's more okay so there's more okay so you guys get the point uh post to it that's it all right now let's get to down to business um i i would say if one of you guys wants to remind me and brian i think that's how it was supposed to be done right uh so that should be good guys i think we're going to be set <clears throat> all right so we have a drone to finish um uh Thanks, George. And, and yeah, and so I'm going to give, uh, let's see, we are now 12 minutes into this video. Um, let's just say at like the 30 minute mark, I'm going to go ahead and give uh, the second dragon uh, frame away. Um, it is actually still on the bench for cutting. It was cut a little bit, but I stopped it to pull this one off. I will finish that one and send it out. So somebody's going to win the frame that we just did here. They're going to win one of those. Um, and we'll give a bunch of stuff away tonight, man. And you guys have been patient with me and I have been holding out for the thousand mark. And so I am about to, uh, oh yeah, there's another thing and get ready for this one. Um, I'm about to start doing all our deals to our YouTube subscribers. So here's what's going to happen. Starting tomorrow, um, I am going to start putting specials on and here's a hint. Uh, no, I didn't get the iPad. Um, I did get asked, uh, by, I had a, a couple people, um, and I actually, uh, I have to say thanks to Travis also. Travis actually has a ton of them. It's the business he does. So if any of y'all ever need some help, uh, that guy's got it. And I'll send y'all a link. But I did not uh, get it. Uh, I did order one from Dustin today, but I'll take a couple more for right now. I have a test that I'm working on for some drones. Unfortunately, my schedule, uh, some things have come up that have caused me to have a little delay. I will be, I will be doing that, though, and I, I, and I will be getting from you guys. So please hit me up with it. Uh, uh, blow your video up. Oh, um, okay. Oh, me? Oh, yeah. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, let me do that. Boom. There. Better? Better. Okay. Yeah. Hey, and I'm getting a coffee. Yeah. Um, babe, I want everybody to pick some awesome stuff to give away for tomorrow. Okay. I'd like to give a goggle set away. I'd like to give a transmitter away. I'd like to give some of those small drones away. I mean, I want to go crazy. Tomorrow, I want to go crazy. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Not right now, though. I got to talk to everybody right now. We got to get drones ready. Put your smile away. You know, don't, don't, don't go that crazy. All right. Um, uh, okay, so uh, um, one of the things that we're going to be doing is we're going to be doing some crazy sales now. I've got to move some product, and I want to thank you all again. So I'm going to be dropping some prices on some crazy stuff, like motors. Um, you will have a very limited time, and it will only be posted through YouTube video, which means I will post a video, and it will say today's specials. If you're subscribed, you're going to see it. If you're not subscribed, you won't see it. Those specials will run until I'm sold out. It'll be things like this. Um, Rudy, send me an email, Tarek at CycloneFPV.com, and, uh, and, or hit me, send me a personal message, whatever you call those things, PMs or whatever, and, uh, and uh, let's arrange, and I'll take yours as well. I'll buy yours from you as well, okay? And then I've got to get the rest. I'll get the rest from Travis, uh, and I appreciate you and Dustin helping me out. Um, and so what it's going to be is like, take, for example, like this. Uh, you'll, you'll have to order, let's say, four of them or six of them or I don't know, whatever. But I'll be doing things like T-Motor Motors for like 15 bucks, okay? 
it's going to be insane. Okay? I mean, like, insane. Um, you, but it's only for YouTube subscribers, and, and so you're going to want to get people, you know, I'm going to need your help with that. Get more people in there and stuff. But uh, I'm going to be doing, um, I mean, I don't know, flight controllers that are usually, I mean, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm just going to go nuts on it. It's going to be insane. All right. And the idea is I waited for a thousand. You got me to a thousand. I owe you guys in return. So we're about to kick some serious ass on some pricing. Okay. Now, no more wasting time. Subscribe, support. We're doing one video a day. And by the way, I'm going to stick with my one video a day plan Monday through Friday. If I do not do one video a day, I will give a free quad away that week. Okay, that is my guarantee to you guys. Monday through Friday, there will be one video every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday of some content, whether it's a build or a new product or whatever. And if I miss it, that, that weekend, I will give a brand new fully built quad away. That's my way of telling you I'm serious now, okay? All right, let's get to it. So we've got this, uh, we've got this Dragon drone sitting right here. Um, and uh, and uh, I give you the top view of it right here. I need to adjust the camera just a little bit, please. There we go. Uh, and so there is our top view of the camera or of the uh, drone and there is my ugly face with it Okay, so let's do this What we are going to do now is we have the build is done and now what we need to do is we need to work on beta flight, right? So let me get back over here. Let's open up beta flight real quick and um, And we do know that the build itself is finished uh, And we will we've got our cameras our our setup here is really nicely done and this is the um, Chaos 1407s by Brother Hobby. Uh, and so let's get going. Um, first things first, we need to, I guess, let's give it some power and make sure we don't. Uh, I think we did this on the last video, but I do not remember. So I'm just going to go ahead and test this, make sure it's as clean as possible so I don't fry this thing. Um, and uh, then we can get started, okay? And I will be checking on here as well. All right. Uh, Okay. No, nope. and I think we're looking good there. Now, what you'll notice on here, um, and I will actually do go this route first. So what you're gonna notice right here is I'm gonna use um, these plugs instead for right now. So I put on these um, bullet connectors just to ex extend the um, XT60, all right, for the time being. Uh, and so let me go ahead and just get this on here and let's see if we can get a system to work properly this way, and then we'll start programming it a little bit more. Okay, and then let me get my USB cable, which is right here. Okay, so our USB is in, which means that our um, beta flight's gonna kick in here, which it has, but you can't see that screen right now. So let me just kinda put this here. And I'm hoping that the VTX does not interrupt the video feed. I didn't even think about that. So let's let's see if we can do this. There we go. And there. All right. So there we go. We've got our beta flight going on, uh, and we are running the F440. So let me um, let me reset everything, and let's go to calibrating, and then let me grab my keyboard, and let's get some stuff done here real quick. First thing is I want to go to my version and make sure where I'm at on this. So let's type version. And I am running the 4.03. I'm probably actually gonna step that down. So let me go ahead and just do that real quick because uh, actually, let me go back here. I wanna see something real quick. Let me do that one more time. Okay, so yeah, let's go back. I have a small lag here, so I keep thinking I'm off it. All right, I'm gonna take this to 3.4. Uh, 3. Let me see, I'll go to August 3.5. And I'm just gonna load the firmware and uh, we're gonna flash it real quick. All right, so while that's going on, um, let me see if I can adjust this here. What is this? Okay, I think that's good, I think we're good. I do hesitate to power this up. I'm afraid this VTX is gonna interfere, but we gotta do it, man, there's no way. Um, hey, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We're, hey, yeah, there's a, I think I can actually do, it's funny. I think I can do three of these stupid things. Let me see. I don't know how this works, but this, which one is it? Is it this one? Nope. I don't know what it is. I'm going to try to fl figure this out. 
Uh, one, two, split screen. No. Let me see if I can make this work. One, two. No, that's not it. Whoa. That's, that may be it. No. Oh, yeah, that's it. Hey. Oh, hell, this is getting fancy. Look, I can do four screens. <laughs> no need for that, though, right? So let's try that. There. Boom. Now you got my ugly mug in the middle. <laughs> What's up? Um, all right, yeah, well, we don't need my ugly face either, so let's just do two. Quit screwing around. Here we go. If I can figure this damn thing out there. Bam. Okay, back to normal. All right, so we've got our, uh, we've just done the firmware uh, flashing, so there we go. Uh, and now we are going to, uh, let's see. Probably the first thing is going to be now we go, 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 turn it on. Now, look, if there's an interruption on the video feed, hang tight. I will get back in this. I'm hoping there's not going to be, uh, but there's no telling at this point. If anything, I may have to disconnect the, um, the uh, VTX. But here it goes. So if there is an interruption, don't go anywhere. Just hang tight. Okay. So I'm going to be looking to see if we have an interruption here. I'm going to try to keep moving around and see if I see this thing hesitate or not. And, woo, nope. Looking good so far. Okay. So um, one of the things that we want to do is we want to grab our monitor and the main thing is I want to test and make sure that we have, uh, uh, I'm looking at the screen though and I want to make sure that we're not frozen. I don't think we're frozen. I think we're actually still running okay. All right. Um, so here is our monitor and we want to make sure that we have video and look at that. So we've got our video. Uh, so we are, there's our hand. Yeah. So everything's good on the video side. Our VTX is working well. So that part is good. Um, excellent. Excellent idea there. And by the way, I think I will be giving one of these monitors away tomorrow as well. So look forward to that. You guys will be hooked up pretty good with that one. Um, looks like everything's running good so far. Now what we need to do is we need to go to our configuration and make sure that we have everything set up properly. I will set this up as uh, one shot 125 for the time being um, because I want to do a, a full calibration. So let me save this real quick. Uh, yeah, thanks, guys. And that's right. You're right. You can do a bunch of different angles. So I can give you uh, one, two, uh, three, and four. Uh, although I look stupid when I do that. But you can do, you know, you get the top, you get the front, and then you get your other one. Or we can uh, just remove that and just do the two different angles or what have you. I guess, I don't know. It's making me dizzy looking at all this. All right. Um, all right. So we are now going to go ahead and update our, uh, we're going to do our ESC firmware real quick. Let me go ahead and jump on in there. Uh, I think this is actually, I may not be on the right. This may be 32 bit. Let me see. I cannot remember if I'm using, yeah, it is. I had a feeling it was. All right, so let me get out of this. Let's go back down and let's open the BL Heli 32. Okay, and we're going to get started on here and make sure we've got our ESCs updated. All right, so running the 40 amp ESC. So let's go ahead and just, just going to flash it just because might as well anyway. And I think 32 points, uh, so, yeah, it is. It's the newest one, but let's just go ahead and knock it out. Okay. So uh, while we're doing that, uh, and we'll let that run. So let's see if I can go one, two, three. There we go. And we'll, we'll shrink that down. And there is my weird face in the middle. Uh, now it's in the middle. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and update the ESCs real quick. And then we're going to do is a, we're going to do a calibration on the motors, make sure everything is set right. And we're going to spin them up and make sure everything's running right, right direction, right, everything. Um, outside of that, uh, the only thing left to really do will be to bind the receiver. Um, and flight test this in the morning, uh, but you can at least, uh, we're gonna at least test it out now and then start giving stuff away, right? And we are uh, seven minutes away from giving away the frame, okay? So uh, hang tight and we'll do that. And let me just click through all this real quick. Um, and if you guys have any questions while I'm doing this, uh, you will see that we got some new motors in from Brother Hobby. These are not Chaos Series. These were not tagged with our logo. Uh, I did not want to order that many this time around. I just want to kind of get an idea of what motors you guys want. So I put them on yesterday. And some of you, if you're on our email list, you already received those, uh, the advertisement for it. Um, I also went through our inventory of open items. I know some of y'all have been asking me about open items. We are going to put a bunch of those together for you guys. You've got motors, flight controllers, everything open, tested or just brand new, but not in a box. I've got about 30 receivers uh, that I'm going to discount, about 30 cameras. Um, and some stuff, so we'll work on those too. Uh, in the meantime, um, I need to just shut up and keep clicking, so let me do that. Let's click close right there, and let's do this. Okay, uh, who does your animation? I don't know what that is, what animation? Um, I don't know what the animation means, 
But if you can, oh, you mean like the flying logo? Oh, uh, uh, there's a company that I, I mean, it's a website and I just make it, uh, I make it using their software and I'll find it for you. It starts with an M, I think. Sorry, that's all I got right now. But uh, I can send that to you. Um, just send me a message. Uh, oh, thanks. Yeah, well, <laughs> I, I can tell you, you can't park a car in here or in the other garage. Uh, they're stacked, but uh, thanks, man. It, it allows me to work from home and run the business from the house, and that's how I, I wouldn't have it any other way. Um, uh, so I'm going to do a bunch of motors. Uh, we're going to do a huge sale starting tomorrow. Again, it's going to be, please subscribe um, and keep subscribing. Keep getting people to subscribe. I've got so much stuff in here. Uh, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. There's going to be a lot, a lot of stuff that I'm going to discount just because, I mean, I want to sell, I want to make frames. Uh, I don't mind selling any other stuff, but my passion is frames. So I want you guys to be able to get the stuff that you need at an affordable price. Let's see what we can do. Uh, okay. So we're almost done here. Uh, we're about to flash the last ESC and then, uh, let me see what else. I guess that's it. Um, we'll do some programming and then we'll fire the motors up and then I'm gonna get that little quad that's hanging right there that you guys can't see. I don't know if y'all have seen this one yet. I know I showed it to y'all before. Uh, uh. Okay, so this was one that, you know, I, I know I've shown it to you guys, but um, I, it's been a while and I was gonna do a full video on this one. This sucker is fast, it's super fast, and it's awesome, and it's tiny, uh, about that big, right? Um, and. Uh, this is going to be our next video is going to be on this one and I'm going to try to get you guys to jump in these. Oh, by the way, on the motors, what reminds me is that I got the Brother Hobby 1103s, I think, is that what they are? 1103, 8,000 KV and 11,000 KV. I just put them in the system. So check those out as well. Um, they're, uh, uh, and then I got the Avenger 2s and I think everybody, RDQ, get FPV, I think they all got them for like $25.99. Uh, they're on there for $19.99 on our site and um, I'm pretty much going to start keeping it like that or less. So get ready, okay? Because I want to move product and bring new product in daily. So let's see what we got. Okay, so we're almost done. That's it. The last ESC is flashed. So we are now going to be good to go on this one. So let me go ahead and click OK. And um, we are going to write to this. And let's see if everything looks good. Everything does look good. So click OK. We're going to disconnect. And then my habit here where it tells you to... After uh, flashing it uh, to restart the ESC by disconnecting and reconnecting. So this is a really good thing that you guys need to do. And I've noticed that some people, when I've gotten some stuff in, have not done this. So please try your best to do this. In this case, I'm just going to disconnect uh, my ground from the LiPo. And I'm also going to, out of habit for me, I'm going to disconnect the USB. All right. Now, I do that on my own because I like to remove all power. Oh, God, that USB. That, that video is hot. So I may need to be... A little careful here. I think what we'll do right now is we're going to go ahead and just fire up the motors, right? So let me go ahead now. We've reset everything. Now I'm going to go ahead um, and I'm going to plug in my ground here. All right, excellent. So we know that's good. Now I'm going to disconnect the USB again because I forgot here I need to calibrate. So let me just minimize this and we're going to disconnect. All right, now in this case what i want to do now is i'm going to go ahead and calibrate the motor so to do that i'm going to plug in my usb and remember this is because we're on one shot right so i'm going to plug in my usb and what does that say i want to build a three inch but i need motors in the stack what would you recommend okay so rudy here's the deal and george i'll hook you up with this one man i mean this was the first one i did and it's awesome uh it's a unibody it, like i said it's fast i really love this thing um and if you can see underneath it i mean the whole build is done really i'm really proud of this build um uh, and it's got the uh, integrated camera uh, rush FPV on here uh, and I we have our own uh, mount that we made for this and so you'll love it um okay so Rudy on yours for a three inch build look I, I'm gonna tell you flat out um, uh, there's a couple different options because of the props that you can use right you can use uh, T style props or these kind of props where you get the two screws to go inside or you can use a standard prop um, I have a three inch uh, prop, a quad, that is sitting right above my head right here. Um, and let me kind of pull that down and show you. This is one that I built a while ago, uh, but I did not really put it for sale because um, people were complaining, and I, I understand people were complaining the quads are too fast that I was making, okay? Um, 
so, but this is it here, right? So this is one of the ones that I designed. This is a three inch quad and it's a beast, right? But it's a real beast. It's not like a, oh, tiny beast. This sucker will move. And unfortunately that kind of put a couple people off because it was fast. But one of the coolest things about this one was it was, it could go either way, upside down or right side up and it fit a GoPro session, right? So I designed it to be under 250 grams with the session. Uh, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, uh, memory serves me right. So the session mounts up here, right? So this is what you see, okay? And I think I could probably give you a better angle of that. So let's just try that. So here's, here it is, right? Um, and this is, I'm telling you, it's a beast of a, it's a beast of a quad. It's got everything on it. Um, and so the session sits like this, right? Uh, but on the flip side, you could take this quad and <clears throat> reverse the motors on the back, and that's what it was designed for. It could fly either way, so these motors and props could be up, and that way you get rid of all your uh, prop wash, right? And this, this motor would be on top. And I used to have one here mounted like that, but I don't see it right now, which means I don't know where I put it, but that's how I flew it. The problem is it was too fast for people, and it didn't, and, you know, it was great for me, but too fast for everyone else. This is something I would look into doing, um, and then uh, on these I use the uh, F10 or F15 motors, um, but uh, we've got some new motors from Brother Hobby, so I will address the three inch build tomorrow in a video, and um, we shall see if we can do something for you with recommendations on motors, props, and ESCs and so forth, okay? So let me get back now to here, and we'll go one, two, three, bam, there we go. All right. <clears throat> So we are about to calibrate the motors. We are plugged into Betaflight. This is actually plugged in and ready to go. So I'm gonna reset, reset. And now we're gonna go ahead and calibrate. Uh, and let me go ahead and crank this all the way up. And then let's make sure that we can. Okay, so at this point, we're done for the most part, but what we're gonna do now is we're gonna disconnect from beta flight and we're gonna go back to our um, BL Heli. And remember, we're running one shot 125, right? Uh, yeah, George, and, and look, uh, uh, you know, you're, <laughs> yeah, it's not really that. I mean, it's like, look, I just can't, I've tried. And even my buddy, my, my good, good, good uh, uh, friend was uh, letting me know, his, his name's Jeff, right? And, and he's, he's cool, and he, Jeff Campbell, and he, took one of the smaller ones I made and was like, man, it's awesome, but you can't fly this shit indoors, it's too fast. I'm like, I don't know, I, I just can't make it slow, I guess, but um, I'm trying. I mean, I, I guess you could govern it, you know, by, by changing your um, limits on your uh, transmitter, I guess, I don't know, throttle, throttle max. Um, okay, so let me go ahead and check out what we're doing here. So uh, I'm gonna go down and re-check uh, out the min and max that came up on this. And so motor one was 1014, 1999. 1018 208 was number two. Uh, 1019 uh, 2012, number three. So we know that the minimum throttle has to be the maximum number. So the maximum number I think is going to be 1020. So they're all going to be 1020. And then the maximum throttle has to be the minimum number, which I think is going to be 1999. So we're going to go ahead and click all of these and bring this down to 1999. And uh, let me see if I can get that right. And 1014. And we're going to write this and make sure that all the motors uh, show the same thing. Okay, so let's see. Two is now, three is now, four is now. Okay, good, excellent. So these are all set. And with that, we're going to remove throttle calibration in the future. So let's do that. And we're going to write all these. And we're going to spin the motors up, make sure they go in the right direction. And at that point, we know the camera works. Uh, we know the motors will work. And then this thing is going to hit the air. If it wasn't nighttime, it would be flying. Uh, hey, pa Paul. You can be late to the party. This is your quad. I mean, you are the man. This is yours. This is the project we worked on. And guys, I got to tell you, Paul's been a trooper because this has taken me two months. <laughs> and I think I told him it would be like a week or two, but it has been a project. Um, not to mention that there's been a lot of other stuff going on, but I appreciate that Paul's been very kind to allow me to continue to work on it. Um, it was a from scratch deal and, and it came out good. All right, so let's go ahead and connect back. First, um, let's go ahead and connect to Betaflight. And let's give our motors a test now. Uh, let me actually power this down real quick. All right, we're gonna connect. Let's go to our motors. 
And let's see if we can get something. Okay, let me get this USB out of the way. And please remember, there's only two screws in here. So that's clockwise. That's clockwise. That's counter. And that's clockwise. So we have, we have three going the right direction. And we'll just use this as a simple test. Okay, so that's, yes, that's right. That's wrong. That's right. And that's right. So motor two is spinning the wrong direction. Let's go ahead and fix that real quick. And then we'll actually, uh, but we do want to test motor one. So motor one needs to read right. Let's make sure that it does. So let's turn this on and go motor one. Okay, that's wrong. So we have some resource mapping to do. So if you guys want to see that real quickly, let me get a pen. And let me get a piece of paper and we might as well knock out some resource mapping while we're at it. Okay. Uh, let me find a piece of paper that works. Piece of paper anywhere in this house. Here we go. Be right back. Okay, so let's resource map real quick, right? And this is how we're going to do it. When I flip motor one, uh, when I flip motor one, I think motor three spins. So what we're going to do is in our notes, great, I have a red pen and pink pen out of paper. And you can tell my wife has raided my garage. We're going to have to talk to her a little bit. All right. So uh, we're going to do a resource uh, map. So we know 1 equals 3. And we're going to check number 2. 2 equals 1. And we're going to check number 3. 3 equals 4. Boy, this is all screwed up. And then we know 4 equals 2, right? So we need to remap these, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and turn our motor off. And then go to our CLI. And we're going to type resource. And we're going to scroll up and we're going to see that motor one is um, uh, B00, which is three. So that's B00. Uh, yeah. And then motor two, which makes spins to one, is B01. And then motor three, which spins to four, is A03. And motor four, which spins to two, is A02. All right. So we need to make these mappings change. So what we're going to do is we're going to say, um, Actually, I'm just going to copy and paste it here because it'll be easier. So let me just take these out, go to copy, open a notepad, and click file, new, and I'm going to paste this. There it is. Okay, and then we know that we need to change, and we need to say, I'm going to paste it again, and this time I put the right numbers. So we know that when motor one, to get motor one to spin, we had to use B01. So we're going to change this to B01. Okay, and then we're going to go to make motor 2 spin, we had to use A02. So this is wrong. We're going to go to A02. Okay, and to make motor 3 spin, uh, we had to go to B00. So motor 3 is going to be B00. And to make motor 4 spin, uh, we had to go to A03. So we're going to change this to A03. And then we know that we need to save it. So we're going to type that in. And we're going to highlight these four lines. Click copy. Come over here. And we're going to control V, paste it, and hit enter. Okay, and there you go. Now, uh, <laughs> so here we go. Let's, uh, let's disconnect, reconnect, and let's give our motors a shot now. So let's scroll down, and let's see if we got it right. So motor one, uh, we have nothing. Let me reset my ESC. Sorry, guys, one second. Let me disconnect. There we go. Let's connect, reset. Go to motors, and now let's see if motor one spins. Okay, motor one is on one, and it's spinning the right direction. Motor two is on two, and it is spinning the wrong direction, so we need to change that. Motor three, oh, jeez, chill out. Motor three is on three, and it is spinning the wrong direction. And motor four is on four, and it's spinning the right direction. So we have motors one. Well, I'll just turn them all on. Now, now we know their math, right? Let's just make sure. I think they're all spinning... Hold on, let me get let me get a little bit more power. Let me get a little bit. Okay, chill out a second. All right, all right, all right. Okay, motor three is actually spinning the right way. I think it's motor two. And motor two is spinning the wrong way. These suckers are fast, man. They're killing me. All right. And then motor three. All right, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna change motor two. Three is right, and then one and four look right. Um, one is right and four is right oh my gosh okay so there finally so let's go back now to our bl heli and let's change our motor direction to motor two 
and we are going to be done. So we have motor two right here, and motor two needs to be reversed, and we're gonna write that, and everything else is running smooth. So now, if I go ahead and disconnect, and go back, close this out, go back to our beta flight, and go to our motors, and then let me go ahead and do this. That's the right way, that's the right way, that's the right way, and that's the right way. We are golden, guys. Everything is looking phenomenal. And we have a lot of power here. A lot. This sucker is going to be very powerful. All right, so that takes care of that. Um, and now we will go through, I'm gonna shut the board down now so we don't have to mess with any of that. And we are going to activate our UARTs. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna use our smart audio on TX6. Uh, and we are going to have our UART1 for our USB, or our, I'm sorry, our S bus. So I'm gonna save that. And on my configuration, now that I know it is all clean, I can switch it to D-Shot if I want to. Um, but for right now, my testing, I will not switch it to D-Shot. I will, however, change this to my minimum throttle to be 1070, and that'll take care of that. Uh, I will not have any of these, and I will change this to four and four for my own sake uh, 25 will stay uh, now one of the things that we have to do now is we have to oh man you know what I totally forgot is we have to adjust the board uh, cal uh, the board um, angle right because one of the things that you will notice if you try to fly this thing without doing that is if I pick it up forward it's going at an angle right so here's down and it's going at an angle because the board is actually turned right so uh, let's reset that and let's go to our configuration. This is something that I, I forget to do every once in a while and it ends up costing me uh, a, a quad flying out of control for a little bit. So <clears throat> let's go to yaw and let's go ahead and take it to, let's go to minus 45 degrees and click save. And let's see if that does it. I always, sometimes I tend to miss this. So bear with me if I screw this up. <clears throat> All right, so here we go up. Oh no, that's the other way. I turn it, so let me just disconnect that. That's definitely not right. Uh, let's go back down and just make it to 45 degrees. I'm not looking at the arrow here, so I could have been, it could have been a positive 45 for all I know. Let's click save and reboot. Well, come on. Uh, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm probably the worst person to beta flight, but I sure as hell try. <laughs> all right, let me disconnect and reconnect. And now let's see, up. Down, left, right, perfect. So we are positive 45 degrees, uh, board is turned. So now we are um, now we are calibrated properly. Everything is set. We know we're gonna be running SBUS. And uh, so let me go ahead and just put that on there. I'll save that as well. Uh, our CPU load is still looking pretty good. Um, uh, I will deal with the dynamic filtering later and see what we got. And then all these buzzers, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and turn those off. So I'm just gonna go to the CLI, put beeper, Minus all. Uh, I hope that's it. I don't see anything on here. Hello? Hello? I don't know what happened. Let me connect again. See a lot. There we go. So let's do beeper. Hey, beeper. Minus all. Enter. All right, now they're all disabled. That way I don't have to hear a bunch of beeping, I guess. Okay. Okay, so, uh, okay, Ricardo, let's see if I can help you with that real quick, okay? Um, so, uh, one of the biggest problems that people have when they try to do arming with beta flight, right? And I'll try to make this simple because we have to give a frame away here. Oh, I'm 20 minutes late on the frame, shit. Um, so, uh, here, here's one of the things that most people do, what, what they'll miss, okay? So, <clears throat> when you go to your receiver, now my receiver's not set up for this one yet, so I can't really show you much more than this. But here's where it's really important. First thing, obviously, is I'm gonna be running TAER, which is gonna be on the third option here. And that's how I know my throttle and everything is gonna be adjusted properly. But here's where I would recommend that you make your change, okay? One of the things that you're gonna to wanna to change in this is gonna be the fact that your, your stick low threshold, I don't know why it's set at 1050 now. Uh, I liked it better when it was set at 1000 and you had to adjust it. Um, I set mine at 1005, okay? And I set my other one at 2000. Now, I understand it may not make sense, it may not even be necessary, but it is for me for, um, I guess, for the way I just do it. It's the habit that I do, right? Um, but here's what's important, and here's what most people will miss. 
the most important thing for you to do when you are getting this done uh, is to make sure that you've calibrated your controller first, right? And if I can, I will show you, gosh darn it. Um, I tell you what, I'm gonna take this quad off, I'm gonna show you real quickly, uh, but let me save this real quick because I wanna make sure that this is done because we're flying it in the morning. Um, so I've gotta pair it tonight, bind it tonight, uh, and then I'll set everything else up. So I'm just gonna go ahead and save this now, and then I'm gonna show you something on the one that you're talking about. Uh, hey, thanks, what's up guys? <laughs> um, so let me go ahead and disconnect this now. <clears throat> I think the next thing to do is we're going to go ahead and give the uh, frame away, right? So um, one person is going to win uh, this frame that is still being cut on the bench. So it will, just as a heads up, it will be cut tomorrow because I am cutting a, um, a big uh, job for a customer. And so it'll all be cut tomorrow. And so whoever wins this, I'll let you know. You'll pay the shipping to get it wherever you're at. That way, if you win it and you're in Australia, you can win it. You just have to pay for shipping. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. So I'm gonna go ahead and make the focus now, the screen, uh, and I'm gonna get the quad off of there, right? So let's do this. Okay, so uh, we're gonna take this off for the time being. And then uh, I will put the details of this Dragon build online so you guys can see the specs and you guys can buy one if you'd like. Um, uh, but the flight test will be in the morning and then you guys can see that video too and then uh, we can take it from there. All right, so let's get back to our YouTube stuff, right? So we were on YouTube and uh, here's the video and I need to refresh. So if you guys have not entered yet, you need to go and enter. Um, uh, okay, so Ricardo, I'm gonna show you how to do that, okay? Um, I'm gonna show you how to do that on your, okay, now it keeps leaving my video, so I got to figure out why. How do you go back? How do you go back? No, oh, this? Yeah, there, boom. Okay, guys, so uh, I posted the link to this video on our fa Facebook page. Holy crap, a bunch of things on here. Um, uh, so, yay, they wrote Facebook. Hey, you're very, you're very welcome. Very welcome. Okay, guys, so you basically want to be on this page. And for those of you that are just tuning in, there will be one video link uh, on every live video feed that we do on Facebook. There will be a link to a YouTube video. And all the video is is this introduction, and it'll tell you what date, uh, the prize is for, right? And it'll tell you, all you need to do is comment Cyclone FPV and do it one time, okay? <clears throat> and you have to be a subscriber. That's the, that's the given. And so um, I have this many people that have posted so far. And um, if there are any new ones, it'll refresh automatically on its own when I do the, the prize. Um, oh God, this thing's gonna skip again. Okay, so make sure that you've commented because I'm about to do this and uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to click our, I think it's our TubeBuddy link, and we're going to go to our comments. Is that right? No, maybe not. I don't know. I'm still trying to get this right. So bear with me a second. Stop playing this video. All right, that's enough of that. It's enough. It's enough. All right, bear with me, guys. All right, so maybe it's here. Maybe it's here. Here. This is it. So we want to do a pick a winner, right? So it's going to pick a winner, and... I'm gonna be specific and say that I want the comment to be, and it has to say C-Y-C-L-O-N-E, okay, F-P-V, right? Make sure you've entered, because I'm getting ready to do it, so this is it, all right? Um, so I'm gonna give you guys one minute. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna take, let me go, I wanna check on my boys real quick. I'm sorry to do this to you guys. I'm just gonna give you guys about one minute to keep uh, make sure that you've commented the Cyclone FPV and that video link. And if any of you can't find it, please, somebody will post it real quick. I need to check on my kids real quick, so give me one sec. I'll be right back. Be right back. Don't go anywhere.
Okay, so hope everybody had the chance to do that. Everybody inside's doing good. They're getting ready to kick my butt in Rainbow Six Siege. Okay, guys, so does everybody understand? Um, uh, yeah, I, I can't calm mine down. They're, they're, they, uh, we have a bet on who gets the most kills in Rainbow, and um, I'm losing a lot of money right now, so I'm trying to train when they're not here. I'm not telling them that I'm doing that. So we are going to give a frame away, right? And we are going to give the dragon frame away, the second one that we have. So I'm going to tell it to pick a winner. And guys, again, I hope this is the most fair diplomatic way to do this. So if you find a problem with it, let me know because tomorrow, do not forget, we are talking about um, a phantom, one of my phantom, my personal ones, DJI phantoms. And we're talking about a lot of prizes that my kids are going to help me give away for you guys to congratulate uh, us and thank you all for hitting our thousand subscriber on YouTube. Okay, so let's not waste any more time. Uh, if there's any glitches with this and you guys know it, please let me know. Uh, and I want to thank uh, Brian for helping me with this one. Brian Weller, he's the one who came up with this uh, idea and it seems to be working well. So one last time, uh, I am going to tell it to basically pick a winner from all the chats, from all the posts on here. So without wasting any more time, let's do pick a winner. And the comment has to be Cyclone FPV. And here we go. This is the winner for the freight. Here we go. Well, here's the um, here's the refresh. Now this is this is the actual video itself, um, right? So there are there are uh, quite a few comments here, and then the software will actually pick it uh, out of that. So if I was to hit refresh here, that's fine. But it's going to pick it. Yeah. Good luck to everybody. Seriously. Um, Please make sure, again, if you've commented, obviously you need to be a subscriber. So let's get this show on the road, shall we? No more delays. Remember, it has to say Cyclone FPV. And here we go. Good luck, everyone. All right? Cool. Here we go. So the winner is We the Humans. Oh, my gosh. You know what? I think I know who this is, and I'm going to see. I'm going to see... Um, I'm going to, I need to see if this is right. Golly. Um, okay. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of drifting off here because I think I know who that is. Meaning I think I know who the person is, not personally, but just know them from being online. Uh, I'm curious. I don't know how to find that out, but I'm going to click this and, um, David, is this the guy that has been posting on our Facebook page? Um, that's it. Man, I'm going to tell you something. I am so excited that that guy got it. Oh, you know, he, I, I got to tell you, man, I, I, this, this guy is, has been, um, has been just, you know, just good, good all around people. And I am excited. Uh, to be able to uh, get this taken uh, uh, get this taken care of, I am excited. So, uh, congratulations! Um, and uh, let me let me uh, let me click this. I want to see what I see when I click this. Yeah, that's it. I am I am extremely excited and very proud to uh, have this done. So, look at that. I mean. Congratulations, uh, you know, I, I couldn't be happier on this one. Um, and so if everybody is happy with the way this went, right? If, if everybody's okay now, again, guys, I am stressing to you guys, tomorrow is the largest drawing we've done since I've ever done anything online. Um, and so uh, it is gonna be a big deal. Now, I am, since the, since the giveaway is done for tonight, as far as, sorry, since the, since the um, Dragon drone is beta flight is pretty much done, we're going to get it set up. Um, tomorrow's gonna be the flight. I'm gonna post you guys a video on that one. Hopefully, Paul, I don't wreck it and have to start all over. Cross your fingers. Um, uh, I would like to give a couple more things away tonight, all right? Just because I feel like it. And your channel doesn't suck, dude. I mean, I, I can't get a thousand. It took me forever because I'm not good at it. Um, uh, so everybody's is better than mine. Let's just go with that. Let's just leave it at that. Okay, so I want to give some more stuff away tonight just because as, as we'll keep testing this out, right? So please keep posting and let me grab a couple things. Um, David, help me out here. Aaron, help me out. Whoever's on, Dustin, anybody, 
Guys, give me some advice. What can I give you guys? What can I make it? Let's make it fun, right? Let's make it fun. Today is a free night to give some stuff away before we call it a night and um, get ready for tomorrow's big giveaway, right? I want to test some things out and make sure we don't screw this up. So let's pick some things out. Uh, I don't know. I'm at your mercy, guys. What would you like? Uh, uh, I'm going to wait. I'm just going to wait. There's a 35-second delay. If you guys want some free shit, tell me what it is you'd like, and I feel... Battery straps. Okay, let's do a... All right, Rudy. Rudy's the first one to answer, so let's do a... How about a five-pack of the um, uh, Kevlar straps? Okay? Uh, okay, so hold on. i got to make a list here. You guys are aiming good because I like this, so you're not asking me for bars of gold. So let's do um, straps. Uh... Richard, what kind of props are you thinking? Now let's do props. And batteries, okay. A hundred props. <laughs> Fat shark strap. Oh, how about, how about, um, how about, uh, how about we do some of the Cyclone FPV uh, Fat shark straps? Can we do that? Is everybody cool with that too? Because that's got our name on it, so that'd be kind of cool. Get those out there too, right? So let's, if everybody's cool with that, uh, let's do that. And then 5046s. Uh, Dustin, you're getting the props. Uh, they, uh, these are different props than what you want, Dustin. So I know they're talking about something different. Um, let's do some, let's do some fat shark straps. Let's do some um, battery straps, fat shark straps. Uh, Three inch what? Three inch oh, three inch um, props. Okay, um, stickers. Cool. Let's knock it out. Okay. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do battery straps. Okay, I'm gonna do a five pack. Let me go grab them real quick. I only have like a thousand of them, so hang tight. It's gonna be boxes. But let me just grab one. And what I'll do is okay, good. I'll grab the orange set. Okay. So. Now, guys, you need to keep track of this, whoever wins this, because you have to email me, okay? You've got to email me. Tar oh, you know what? Let me see if I can figure this out. Hold on one second. I'm going to do something here for you guys so I don't screw this up. Let me see how I do this. Uh, let me see. Social overlay. And let's do something like... That doesn't help me at all. Um, title. This is dumb. I don't know how to do any of this. Uh, maybe this one. Let's try this. I'm going to do this thing to where it puts my uh, email. Tarek. Where the hell's the at sign on this thing? At cyclone fpv.com. Of course, it doesn't fit on one page. Awesome. What a pain. Uh, hold on, guys. I'm trying to get this. <laughs> what the hell I'm doing? I'm trying. I'm trying to just get this stupid keyboard out of here. All right. Let me see if I can make this work. How do you make the font smaller? Font small. <sighs> Whatever. Um, I I give up. I don't know. I was trying to make this work. Oh, here size. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Tark at Cyclone FPV. Okay, done. Okay, look, watch this. Let's see if this works. Hey, I think that works. That's my email. So if you win, please send me an email. Because I don't know what the heck I'm, I don't, I, I, I've got to have you email me. Don't message me on Facebook because I'll be honest with you, even my, all of y'all who've been messaging me know I'm having a hard time responding because I get a million of them and I cannot sort them out. So email is the best way. So hopefully this is coming up on your screen because I'm not seeing it yet. God, I, I hope I don't screw this up. Uh, anyway, so that's my email. So please make sure to email me. Ah, I see it now. So there it is. Email that, all right? And tell me you won, right? And you've got it. Um, okay, so we're gonna do shirts. So we're gonna do a shirt, sh battery. Uh, I'm gonna do the strap instead, this fat shark strap. Um, strap, okay. And we're gonna do, so let's get started, right? Let me get this stupid thing off the screen. I don't know how that works. I do know I did this, look, see, look at that. Boom, YouTube, boom, Facebook. And then, boom, my, okay. Now I'm getting a little carried away, I got it. Okay, so let's do another drawing, right? So the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna give the battery straps away. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do with these uh, <coughs> a pack of five Kevlar uh, Cyclone FPV straps. So let's give these away next. Make sure you've commented uh, Cyclone FPV on there, and I am going to tell to pick another winner. Ready? Uh, let me. I don't know if I should refresh this or not, but I'm going to anyway. 
uh, just because. All right, so here it goes. Let's pick a winner. Pick a winner. Bam, right there. And we are going to say for this one, we are going to do Cyclone, again, FPV. Okay, guys, here we go. And we are going to pick a winner. Bam. David Easley, you are the winner of the straps. So let me put this down. So we have We the Humans for the frame. David Easley, the straps, lipo. Okay, so that's that. Let's just move right along. Yes, thank you and congrats to Dallas. Uh, and make sure to email me, please, Dallas. And then David, congratulations, you won the battery straps. Make sure to email me on that, please. Um, I am going to jump right into the Fat Shark goggle straps now. Um, and so we are going to say pick another winner again. Uh, Jason, you got to put it on the video, not on here. Uh, so find the video link and get that. All right, so here it goes. So this next one is going to be for the... Um, uh, let's do the fat shark straps real quick. So um, here goes. Pick a winner. Michael Parrish. There you go, big boy. Michael, you won something, and I am so happy that you did. So Michael Parrish wins the stra the uh, fat shark straps for your goggles. Congratulations, Michael. So that's three prizes tonight, and then let's do... Um, I don't have the props set up yet to do that, guys. I'm going to have to get back on that. Um, uh, so let's do one. More. Let's just do one more thing, and we'll call it a night because tomorrow we've got to get. I've got to get ready with my boys to give a bunch of stuff away tomorrow. Um, how about one of these mini quadcopters? Is anybody interested in one? I got a bunch of them in. Uh, they're so high up there, I can't reach them. <laughs> Hold on. Let me see if I can. I'm too short for this job. Hold on. Let me see if I can get this extending arm to get one down for me. Here we go. As I knock myself out with it, so hold on. Oh, come here. Come here, Doctor. There we go. All right, so this will be the last one for the night for now, okay? And then I'll get everything else. So I bought a bunch of these. I got a bunch of them in, um, and uh, so why not? Well, let's try this. So this is one of these Ishin tiny ones. Uh, me and I went a little bang good crazy and ordered a ton of them just because they were cool to give as gifts. Um, so how about I give one of these away, right? Can you see that? Yeah, there you go, all right? A little tiny little quad. It's got a camera on it and everything. Okay, it's a pretty cool little machine. Um, and uh, yeah, Rainbow Six Siege is calling me. You're right. So let's give this away as the last one, right? This is it. This is our last gift for the night, last prize for the night. And uh, I will do the rest of the stuff later. So let me get this down. This is going to be the Ishin. Okay, guys. And this is the last drawing for the night. And then tomorrow will be ready. Tomorrow's a big night, okay? So let me close this down. I'll refresh one more time. I don't know if I have to, but I'll do it anyway. Uh, and let's go ahead and go to our comment and do our pick a winner. And we are gonna use from Cyclone FPV. And here goes, don't forget, you gotta email me afterwards, here goes, pick a winner. And the winner is Colin. Colin, you are the winner of the eSheen. Um, hey, you know what, Carmine, it is fun for me. I mean, this is what it's all about. I have such a good time. So uh, we have Colin, and Colin, as long as it's verified that you, everybody, as long as it's verified that you're a subscriber here, cool. So if all looks well, Colin, you're the one who won the, uh, you guys can't see that here. Boom, the Ishin right here. Okay, and uh, let's let's get my screen back and we'll do it like this. There we go. So Colin wins that one, uh, and that makes our fourth winner. So Colin, hopefully he's watching and knows to email me. And again, guys, I'm so excited to have this little button here. Email me at tark at cyclonefpv.com. That will be how you get uh, to let me know. And um, now let me get this stupid thing off my face there. Okay, now, I gotta tell y'all, all right? And I wanna just be upfront. It has been a very interesting month, an up and down month. We have a lot going on. Family-wise, I got a lot going on. And you guys have been very patient, right? Uh, and I know, trust me, you are very kind when you do not hand me my ass when I am late on something because I've been called out for family stuff or whatever. It means the world to me, which is why I like to give back. So on behalf of me and my family, thank you. From the bottom of my heart, thanks for not giving up on me and thanks for hanging in there while I go through some of these things. I will make it worth your while and I will do everything I can. So tonight was an awesome run. I think our trial run went great. Um, tomorrow, uh, my kids said they wanna do it around nine o'clock. So I'm game for nine o'clock, guys, and I'm going to just 
get let a lot of people know if you can because I really would like this to be something where we can give a couple thousand dollars for the stuff away and just help everyone out right and I hope that it goes to people that will enjoy it uh, please I ask you don't sell anything that you win um, that kind of defeats the purpose just use it for yourself or give it to someone that can use it okay um, God bless guys you are everything for me and I and it means the world to me that you've supported us okay thank you pass it on to your friends and we will see you tomorrow at nine o'clock uh, Paul, I will finish this and do a test flight in the morning. This is awesome. To all you guys at one, please send me an email. Everybody else, God bless. Safe flying and have some fun with your family tonight. I'm going to play some Rainbow Six Siege. See you later, guys. Bye.